How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another episode of the vlog. In today's episode, I'm going to be talking about the importance of collaboration as an independent artist. Yeah, welcome to the vlog, to the vlog, welcome to the vlog, motherfucker. Welcome to the vlog, to the vlog, hope you enjoy your stay. Working with other independent artists has three main benefits. Number one, you get to experience what it's like to create a song with someone else. Number two, you get access to a whole new audience. And number three, it's a hell of a lot of fun. The first one is really important. You need to practice networking, communicating, and working with other artists from now. So later on in your career, when you're approached for a collaboration, you know how to handle the situation. Working with other artists helps you learn what to expect when working with other artists. For me personally, the number one thing that I've learned working with other artists is to have a backup plan. The second point is pretty self-explanatory. When you make music with another artist, you get exposed to their audience too, usually through social media and I guess through the algorithm as well. It's important to make sure that the person you're collaborating with also promotes the song as well. This way, their audience knows that you've got a new song out and so does your audience. When you have these new fans appearing after a new collaboration, make sure to commemorate them and let them know that you appreciate their follow. Lastly, as I said, it's really fun. It's really awesome seeing how other artists' brains work when, you know, uh, faced with a creative challenge or a creative process. And yeah, you learn, you learn a lot about the creative process when you work with other artists. For a lot of you as well, it's going to be the first time you actually have another person to bounce ideas and lyrics off of. I know as independent artists, we usually at this shit completely by ourselves. But when you collaborate, at least there's another person involved in the process that you can ask them for help, advice, or you know, just chat about the song so it's not all just in your own head. The competitive nature definitely comes out as well. You don't want to get shown up on your own song by a feature, right? So. When you get another feature on the song, usually it makes you want to go a little bit harder too, you know, that competitive nature subconsciously just comes out, you know, and I, I think that's, that's one of the greatest things about collaborating is just trying to better one another, but in a, in a very friendly way, you know. So I hope you learned something in this quick video. It's something that often goes overlooked, but it's really, really important to collaborate with other independent artists. And hopefully this video has made you want to reach out to an independent artist and ask them for a collab. Uh, hopefully you make something beautiful with them. Anyways, that's all for this time. Thank you so much for watching. Share this video with a friend if you think they'll like it too. And I'll see you next time. Peace out. It's a trip, I'm a blip on the map. It's so big where we live. Got a chip, bust a pig, then I dip like a fish. Make a wish, let it stand. Can't come in where we sin, where we smoke till trees are thin. Toss